cooking, cooking, cooking with Amy. Let's get cooking. Hi, good morning, everybody. Amy. I have a fun dip recipe that I think everyone get... is going to love. I actually um, make this dip for parties all the time, and people ask me for the recipe. It's quick, easy, but there's a lot of great flavor, and it's something different. It's a layered Greek dip, and you can make a lot of it ahead of time. The first thing I'm starting with is one eight ounce block of softened cream cheese. So if you've got guests coming over for a get together, you can get this part of the recipe done even a couple of days ahead of time. So one eight ounce block of cream cheese. Now I want to season that up with some garlic salt, a little bit of dried Italian seasoning, which is a blend of like oregano, basil, and parsley, just to give that some flavor. A little bit of fresh lemon juice, and a tablespoon or two of milk, just to thin it out a little bit. And then you want to mix that together using a mixer or a food processor just until the cream cheese mixture gets combined with all those great seasonings. You can throw some fresh garlic in here too. I just want to make that so it's nice and smooth. Perfect. So this is layer number one. And I like to do this on a pretty plate. A shallow dish like a pie plate would also work. So this is your cream cheese mixture. And you just spread that out on the plate. Now we've got some fun stuff to layer with this on top of this. You probably had a layered Mexican dip. Well, this is kind of the same idea with some different Greek flavors. So we've got some sliced black olives, just canned black olives, or you could use Kalmata olives. We've got some diced seeded tomato, got some diced cucumber, and I love to serve this with toasted pita bread or pita chips. Okay, so I just spread out the cream cheese mixture onto the plate, just around to the edges, and now I'm going to top with one of the other layers. And my next layer is just hummus. And you can make your own. This is uh, chickpeas and olive oil and lemon juice and garlic and tahini. Or you could buy it already made. We picked this up right at festival. It also comes in some fun flavors. I'm using just the traditional hummus, but you could use a roasted red pepper. Now the key is when you're putting this dip together, you don't want to mix the layers together. And it's also kind of nice if you can see the different layers. So leaving a little bit of the cream cheese mixture around the edge. This is my husband, Bob favorite dip. And like I say, every time I bring it to a party, people just ooh and ah about it and ask me for the recipe because it's just something a little different. Okay, so there goes our hummus. Now, right before serving, I like to load up the rest of the toppings. So um, I've got some diced tomatoes. Some seeded and diced cucumber. I love to use those baby cucumbers or the English cucumbers. And then some black olives. You could also do some onions, some scallions. But this is really fun. You keep this refrigerated until right before serving. Serve it with toasted pita bread or even easier, just bag pita chips. And there you go, my layered Greek dip. Recipes on the website. You can also pick it up at any area festival foods. Enjoy.